See you, Jesse. See ya. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to show you Jesse. He's been on 24 hour lockdown, uh, solitary confinement, I think is what they call it. He's been a bad, crazy steer. I'm going to tell you what. I'm gonna set this up where he can get out of actually this little pen, get on some uh, dry land. I'm gonna put some bedding down for him. But he, his na his days are really numbered, guys. And he, he's been getting out. He's got out of my main perimeter fence four times in two days. He's been ripping fence down, been tearing it up. Uh, so I know it's my fault for not having the barbed wire around or electric fence, but that still doesn't give me any excuse not to be mad at him. <laughs> okay, I guess it kind of does. But anyways, we're going to get him. I'm going to put some more electric fencing around here where he can get out and uh, go around over there in, in the grass during the day. And that night he can come in here and eat, drink, and do all that. So I'm going to show you guys that. You've been bad, Jesse. You've been bad. Missy, you ready to do some work? I am. So what the plan is, I got him pinned up right here and it's been muddy in there, but he, he's been laying underneath the shelter in there. But what I'm going to do is get that Premier One fencing. I'm going to put it out here around this perimeter and just give him like a hundred, it'll be like a hundred foot radius so he can come out here and eat some of this grass and do all that. It just gets him out of that one area. So, so hopefully this fence will hold him in because I'm sick and tired of me and my brother, my father-in-law. My father-in-law actually had to come over and put him in once. Randy, thanks for that. Uh, he came over while we were asleep. I didn't hear the phone ring. Uh, he came over, got Jesse back. Uh, back in the pen and uh, whenever I woke up Jesse was out again uh, so I called my wife and I was like yeah dad already went over there uh, and uh, Randy texted me or called I, think I, talked, I talked to him and he said yeah I went over there once and put him in well when I got up he's out again uh, he's just he has just found it he has found out that he can get out and it, he just gets out every time just because he can so let's try to let's try to prevent that so I got some Premier One fencing over here. It's actually the poultry netting. Um, I think it's 42 inches. Now Jesse could jump right over that. But then I'm going to put some T-post in and run some uh, strands of uh, hot wire and hook it up. And that way the, the taller strands will keep Jesse from jumping over. That's the plan. So let me get this. Uh, let me get this out of the ground. Hold 
Throw them hay bales over and I'll spread them. All right, so I think I got the hot wire set up. Uh, there, they should be in there. There should be some red ones on the back of the truck. Now, I think I got the hot wire set up. I put a strand all the way around it. And we got the premier one fencing to keep the goats and keep Jesse in. Keep the goats out, keep Jesse in. So we'll see how it goes. So I'm going to spread, I'm going to spread some of this uh, hay. Or, I'm going to spread some of the straw around for Jesse so it's not so wet in there. He's eating it already. But he's... Okay, we got Jesse set up. Hopefully, this will be the last time I got to deal with this. Um, I think it's going to work out just right. I'll keep you guys updated. Got to test it. Got to test it. Yeah, it's in the house. Wow. That's it. See you, Jesse. See you. That's just part of it. Uh, raising these animals, you got to have the right setup for him i had the right setup for months until he got so big and figured out he can just push the fence down jump right over um just didn't work out lesson learned i will never raise a steer like this again um it will be a definitely definitely be a different setup next time um i'll it'll, it'll be the way it needs to be i learned a lesson on jesse for sure you can see he's just tore down so much fencing it's been horrible horrible all right guys i'm gonna get off here hope you guys liked the video if you did smash that like button if you're not subscribed Please subscribe right there. Thanks for watching. Catch you on the next video. Thanks, Vincent.